On September 13th, Bethany Christian School held a ribbon cutting for their new lower school addition. This new space will host to lower grades, including the new kindergarten class. Our, our new grade is kindergarten, and uh, when we interviewed staff when they saw the space, before there was anything in here yet, uh, they were really excited. Uh, I remember the kindergarten teacher that we ended up hiring uh, jumping up and down and clapping when she saw the kindergarten space. Over the last several years, Bethany has been working towards becoming a K-12 through school. The new wing is the culmination of years of planning and fundraising. Yeah, it's a really exciting process. Anybody that's been involved in a big building project knows all the time and dedication that it takes from a lot of people. From early on with the design process, working with architects, working with a local builder, Eric Cooley, and, um, and refining the design, it's a really fun process. With a $7.5 million project, Fundraising started long before anything was built. We have just over $1.5 million left to go in this project, and we are excited to finish that up because we have big dreams that will only come after we've completed this part of the process. As fundraising continues, students are taking advantage of the classroom spaces tailored to their needs. We have packed a K through 12 school, or, or last year, a first through 12 school into um, a much smaller space. And so this is just going to give them the space they need to learn in classrooms that were built for their age. Along with the new indoor spaces, there are also several new outdoor spaces for students to use. For really uh, a proud of the indoor outdoor space and our outdoor education program, uh, and you can see that in the kindergarten playground. You can see it in out, outside here in the amphitheater, which are outdoor learning spaces. One of my favorite parts about the project is when you walk into this space, it feels open, it feels airy. There is natural light coming into this building. It is a bright space, a space that demands joy and cheerfulness when you walk in. For Globe News, I'm Mackenzie.